Hey YouTube, so this is the Rugged Outdoor channel. So in this episode, I want to show you what I went through to get my stolen handgun back. In 2013, somebody came and burglarized my home. And they stole four of my handguns. So as of today, I, am a I was able to uh, get two of my handguns returned. Basically, law enforcement found them for me. Okay, the first gun that was returned was found by my local police agency here. And then this is then found by the local ATF agency. So here, you know, I have a, a letter from the Depart Depart Department of Justice. I, I was, it was received May 22nd, 2018. And basically they're telling me that they've cleared my background um, and I got it back. How, how I got to this point was because the ATF notified me that I have, that they have found this handgun and that I need to claim it. And so uh, Eric Anderson, the ATF agent, was kind enough to point me in the right direction, send me information on how to get that. So I contacted Eric Anderson, he pointed me in the right direction, and I sent the information up to the Department of Justice, paid them $20 to clear my background, and so now I have I have my handgun today. So this letter right here basically tells Eric Anderson that I'm clear to own my gun again. Okay. So this right here is a release form that I have to go and sign in order to for them to release my gun. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to show you the top part of it because it's got my gun serial number, and I don't really care to show that on. On YouTube so anywho this is that handgun that was stolen from me it's a Razi Cyclops model 98 uh, M986 it's a 357 model when I first saw it <laughs> I was happy to see it but I was sad to see that it was abused by those losers those animals who stole this handgun as you can see there's a lot of scuff it's pretty dirty uh, I don't know what they've done to it. You can see here the forcing cone there. Okay, it is dirty. And see right there? It's pretty dirty right there too. Right here, it's pretty dirty at the face there. And look at my uh, cylinder. They're pretty dirty. And watch this. This is the saddest part. Look at that. They broke my hand grips. And the loser, the baboon, tried to uh, use a wood screw and tried to, you know, bring them back together. Isn't that something? <sighs> They're animals, okay? Know nothing about guns. And when they broke it, they tried to do crappy things like this. They're not animals, okay? But what, I, but be it that it may, uh, it may, I can always replace the grip here okay so I'm just happy I got my handgun back the spring here is still good so you see there okay this is the Cyclops model okay here you can see Cyclops right there but it's made by ROTC when this gun first came out in the 90s the late 90s it was known or coined as the poor man um, uh, poor man python the reason was because it was really accurate I like it because of the, the heavy underlug here and the compensation here port it uh, when you shoot it even full round uh, 357 it doesn't kick it's really friendly to shoot but you can feel the back pressure coming out of the compensator here All right um, in here you know it's still very nice however uh, it's got scratched right here dinged right here uh, there's some scratch right here um, other than that what I'm gonna do is I am going to be uh, polishing it hopefully to return back to its normal condition but uh, See, the cylinder here is still not loose. It's still very tight. OK, 
like it. It's still okay tight. Um, but that's that. Um, let me know what your thoughts are. It was a nightmare uh, when they stole my handguns. And I'm just so happy I this handgun was found and now it's in my hands again. I have two more that's still wandering out there and I still have sleepless nights. Uh, hopefully uh, the local agency will catch those losers. They're animals. I don't, I don't look at them as human beings because what they do when they steal your guns, they use it to shoot people. They're animals and, that's, and Trump is right. These criminals are animals. They're not human beings. If they were human beings, they wouldn't be doing this. So I'm going to clean this up. I'm going to buy a new handle on it. Once it's done, I'll show you the complete, refinished, refurbished, recleaned gun. Let me know what your thoughts are.